Love the chase and the hunt, and I set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want, and I always give it 100. Don't need a bank. Hey, everybody, welcome to the Nottis D Kicks. Hey, Nottis D Kicks. Hey, Nottis D Kicks. Hey, in the building. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I am going to be reviewing the Air Jordan 13 Lucky Green. So, before I get into the video, don't forget to like comment, share, subscribe to acknowledge these kicks. Turn on the post notification bell to get notified every time myself or D drops a video and follow D on all of his social media links listed down below. So before I get into the video, I just wanna address a comment. So somebody had asked, how come we're reviewing super old shoes on this channel? So first, thank you for the comment. Thank you for watching, thank you for engaging. Oh my goodness, this light's getting. Thank you for engaging. And so, we are a relatively new channel, so that's why. You see all these shoes behind me? We're trying to build up the catalog of videos for Acknowledge These Kicks, so that means that we're going to be reviewing or even unboxing, because a lot of these shoes, my fiance has never worn. So, we're just building up the catalog here on his channel, and then of course, like when we get new shoes, which are coming before December, <laughs> stay tuned for that, we will actually be adding new releases on this channel. So, again, thanks for the comment, thanks for watching, thank you, you know, for that feedback, but yes, this is a new channel, we've only been out like a couple of months. So that's what we're doing. But thanks again for watching and commenting and hopefully you're subscribed to the channel. So, all right y'all, this week my man is out of pocket again so I'm filling in, of course. I'll pop through even when I get new Jordans too so you never know. And this helps me out too, like to build up like my knowledge on these great shoes. So, okay y'all, so this is the Jordan 13 Lucky green okay now I've said this in a video before that one point I did not like Jordan 13s and I don't really know what happened I think there was a shoe that came out I think it was a black and purple ones that I have yet to have yet but they're coming soon and I don't know like I just fell in love with them like overnight my fiance, he loves them. He loves them, and I think 12s. Yeah, whatever. I like it's something. He like well, he likes all Jordan shoes. But anyways, but me, I am a fan of the 13s, and I am a fan of the ones. And these shoes right here, these actually came out in September of 2020. So at that time, we had just moved to Las Vegas, and we got these bad boys. And I want to say due to due to like um due to like the reselling market being so high and then like raffles in stores i think if we didn't get it from shoe palace at the mall we got it from wait a minute either got it from shoe palace or we got them from stock x which we no longer deal with anyways but um, we wore these for Christmas. Now, I'm not gonna show the picture that I have, mm -mm, but my man, he wore these and we wore like these like Christmas, like holiday sweaters and we took pictures. But yeah, I'll show my fiance if I can find it and y'all can see how we rock these shoes. But yeah, like I said, this shoe came out September 2020 and yeah, I think we just wore them one time. I've worn them one time. I have worn them one time. And that was two years ago for Christmas. But this, this right here, let's see. So you have the leather. And at first I thought this was, um, I thought this was like real suede, but it's synthetic. It's synthetic suede. Y'all, I don't know, every time I get these gray shoes, Grade school shoes, I always have like a blemish. You know, it's okay. I, I, I'm not, I'm not like, oh my God, these shoes are wrecked. No, 
these shoes are still in great condition and like yes I've worn them they're not even like that dirty at the bottom which is cool and you have this this thing here actually you know I'm gonna take this off I don't even really know oh it has like the number 23 I don't know if y'all can see it I don't know if y'all can see it but it has 23 and you have the green Jumpman, of course. I actually really like this color green. This is a really cute color. And then you have, it's, ooh, let me back away. Green on the inside with a black Jumpman. Can y'all see that? There you go. <laughs> so. And I am a size six and a half in boys. And this, I don't, I don't remember this being a really hard time to get. Actually, I really do think that we got these from StockX. I, I think we, I think we did. But don't quote me on that. Like I'm ninety percent sure that we got these from StockX. We'll have to do a video on this channel as to why we don't do StockX anymore because it was. At one point it got really really bad service I think some of y'all will already know like what was going on with stock X but I think this was one of the last pair of shoes that we got from that company but you know oh and you have anything else oh you have the green jump in right here and yeah I, I really I really enjoy 13s now I I, at one point, I used to think Jordan shoes didn't like feel good, but I think of like any shoe, you have to like break them in. And so, once I like, well, except for these, I only wore these once, but after I wore like a few of my other Jordans a few times, it's like, okay, they, these feel pretty comfortable, but you know, oh my God. Oh, see, every time I come on camera, I don't even know what happened. Here we go. What the, it's not glue. Oh my gosh. I feel like, let me tell you something. I feel like the grade school shoes are different, made different quality than like the men's. Comment below if you think that too, please. Cause like, and again, like I'm gonna have another cry. I feel like these dope colors only come in men's and grade schools and infants and like women's shoes I don't like those colors. Like, I, I don't have a female Jordan shoe. I just don't. Cause I don't feel like they don't make cool colors like these. I actually, I wanna rock these so bad. Like it matches, it actually matches my shirt y'all. Oh, kind of. I don't think this is a lucky green, but I would still wear this. But anyways, I definitely wanna get some sweats and take some fire pictures with these, with my man. So we can match, but anyway so all right y'all this is the review of the jordan 13 lucky greens with the leather and the synthetic suede at the bottom and yeah let me know if you guys like this shoe or not if you do don't forget to hit the like button if you don't like it give us a thumb down thumbs down it don't matter hey any engagement is good engagement push our content out for us please but now i'm going to wrap this video up if you like this video don't forget to like comment share subscribe to join acknowledge these kicks hit the notification bell to get notified every time him or myself drop a video and follow him again on all of his social media links listed down below y'all and i will see y'all in the next video bye i don't ever slow up no i don't take shit i got no love for the fake if you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up.